Before we start, what is magnetic compass? Magnetic compass in navigation or surveying an instrument for determining direction on the surface of the earth by means of a magnetic pointer that aligns inside with the earth's magnetic field. The magnetic compass is the oldest and the most familiar type of compass and it used to different form in aircraft, ship, and land vehicle by surveyors. Good day guys! I'm Midship on Matuginay Ram Vincent from NJ1A8 and I will demonstrate to you the compass ball, that part of a compass in which the compass card is mounted. The compass ball is housed in the top part of the binnacle, where areas the middle part is accessible through a door housing the corrector magnet extending to the projector towards the forward and now compass card a circle card with magnets attached to its underside the face divided on its rim into point of the compass degrees clockwise from north or both and floating or suspended from a pivot so as to rotate freely Good day guys, I'm Midship Manny Menes. I'm invited to demonstrate and discuss the uses of flinder and binocle. Binocle. The binocle is a cylinder container made of non-ferrous material that houses the different components of the magnetic compasses in that as a wood. A binocle is a waist high case or stand on the deck of a ship, generally mounted in front of the helmsman, in which Navigational instruments are placed for easy and quick reference as well as to protect delicate instruments. Its traditional purpose was to hold the ship magnetic compass mounted in gimbals to keep it level while the ship pitches and rolls. A binocle may be divided into sections if its content typically include one or more compasses and an oil lamp or other light sources. Other devices such as Sun timer for estimating speed may have been stored in the binocular as well. A flinder bar. A flinder bar is a vertical soft iron bar placed in a tube on the fourth side of a compass binocular. The flinder bar is used to counteract the vertical magnetism inherent within the ship and is usually calibrated as part of the process known as swinging the compass, where the deviation caused by this inherent magnetism are negated by use of the horizontal or correctors. Good day everyone, my name is Michi Manjo Jubak, Float Chamber Magnetic. What is Float Chamber Magnetic? The card is attached to a nickel silver float chamber. The cap rests on a region tape pivot. Should the weight of the weight card is considerable, the buoyancy of the float chamber reduces the load on the pivot and allows a frictionless rotation of the card. Good day guys, I'm your midship and relox and I'll demonstrate the uses lover's line. A lover's line is a fixed line on the compass binnacle or radar plan position indicator. Display pointing towards the front of the ship and corresponding to the crop's center line. Gimbal A mechanism typically consisting of rings pivoted at right angles for keeping an instrument such as a compass or chronometer horizontal in a moving vessel. Good day guys, I'm Chipman Enrico e. Palma. Quadrantal Spear the quadrantal correctors are two soft iron spear painted in the bracket on the e either side of the binnacle. The helmet is painted on the top of the binnacle and it's not ferrous. This is the place to protect the compass ball from the weather and harsh conditions. 